Okay, let's open these butter Tallman's comments. Butter <laughs> Almond's comments. <laughs> Thurman Merman Berman Thurman. Hi! Hi! I don't know why I was like, let's say hi in the weirdest way possible. Yeah, that was really weird. Welcome to the Kitchen and Jorn show. Welcome in to our show. Welcome to our kitchen. Where Kitchen and Jorn make a show. Today, we are trying every Trader, Trader Joe's, Joe's cookie. <laughs> but we have a caveat. This Trader Joe's was out of Dunkers. Dunkers is a very famous Trader Joe's cookie that a lot of people love. They're narrow chocolate chip cookies, so you can dunk them more easily. They're really good. I can already tell you they're really great. Yeah. We both had them before. They're really good. I don't want to see any comments about the missing Dunkers. Yes. We are also not trying cookies that are vegan or cookies that we have tried in previous videos. We are trying every Trader Joe's cookie, of which there are 20. Maybe. Put the correct number here. So as per usual, we rate all the food on a scale of just okay, pretty good, really great, and if you absolutely suck, penalty box bad. Penalty box bad, baby. You don't want to end up there, but truly nothing will happen to you or your family if you do. Jen, do you like cookies? I do like cookies. I am partial to hard cookies because my grandma baked for me a lot growing up and her cookies are really hard. Uh, anyway, we're gonna try some cookies. Yeah, hey, Kristen, do you like cookies? Oh, yeah. good, good, good. Yeah, I think cookies are really good. Thanks for asking, Jen. Oh, yes, we're such good friends. Trader Joe's Lacy Cookies. They're dark chocolate almond. It looks like just like a thin wafer with like a layer of chocolate and then another very thin lacy wafer. The line between this and candy is like very, very thin. Very thin. So, uh -huh. Hmm. This feels more like a candy than a cookie. It's a good candy, it's tasty. Uh -huh. With like a little bit of like a burnt caramely taste. So maybe that's the almond. It's I pretty mean, good. Dark chocolate is such a powerful bitter flavor that it sort of tidal waves over everything else that's like more subtle, like almond. Yeah, they are pretty, they're pretty good. good. Yeah, they're pretty good. They're not cookies though. Yeah. Maple leaf cookies, let's do it. I love maple. You do? Yeah. Wow. Holy crap. It's very basic. It's just maple and shortbread. This is like pancake flavored Oreos. Yeah, it's really sweet. Probably aren't my cookie of choice, but they're It'd be good. good with coffee. Yeah. You like maple, so as a maple person, would you say these are really great? These are really great! All right. These are my planet plates. This one is supposed to be Neptune. This one's supposed to be... Poseidon? The sun? Trident? Mercury. <laughs> Cinnamon school book cookies. These are basically like dog treats, but for like toddlers. I mean, that's why they're using the baby font. <laughs> pet treats, but for humans. It is fun in the sense that it's like. It's fun to spell like things. I can't that's wait. A, that's a five. I know it's a five, but you, <laughs> you find an S. Sex. <laughs> can't wait to wait, go to college and finally have some sebex. Have some six boots. <laughs> six sebex. These taste like Cheerios. These don't taste like anything. They taste like, they taste like kind of sweet Cheerios. Yeah. I guess technically they're cookies, but- These I, are dog treats for children. These really feel like this is just, this is, this, <laughs> give this to a toddler. And it will maybe do half of the thing you asked it to do. Yeah. If you can read, these are just okay. Yeah. Chocolatey okay. cats, cookies for people. What? They're the chocolatey cats, cookies for people. Stop giving them to elves. They don't want them. They do not look like cats. This looks like a ghost with a massive ear. I feel like this is like their Teddy Graham dupe. Yeah, oh yeah. Oh, I see, I see the cat now. This well, is let's, like- Let's give it a try. Dog treats for children. Now in chocolate form. Yeah, I haven't tried. <laughs> it's just kind of like a chocolate cracker. It's just like, honestly, chocolate flavored cardboard. It's yeah. chocolate flavored cardboard. It's just like, mmm, cardboard. Yeah, these are just okay. You can get them out of here. They're like the cookies that you take home from the bar at 2 a.m. because there's no other better cookies to eat. Sex. You don't cookies. <laughs> <laughs> All right, time for the Trader Joe's way more chocolate cookies. So these are just like very chocolatey and you can kind of tell. These are dog treats for college students. These are also hard cookies. So you think yeah. I would like them, but maybe. Oh, these, are, these taste like oh, Chips Ahoy. Mm. I think the correct proportion of dodo chips, in my opinion, for the perfect cookie is one third chips, two thirds dough for big cookies and half and half for small cookies. And I think this one nails it. It does have, I mean, again, like truly it's like kind of, it's like, these are like the, if we, um, what was that? <laughs> I think right, they're pretty right. good. For box chocolate chip cookies, these are like perfectly acceptable. Uh -huh. But like, I think they're not the top of their genre. Well, Sidebar, it's... Kristen wants to tell a story that she likes. <laughs> it's not related to the video. So, one of my favorite things I learned about you recently is that you thought the lyrics to the song My Sharona were 
it went, my Sharona by, by the neck, neck, by the neck. Which, which I is, later found out is just me singing. <laughs> head, shoulders, knees, head, and toes. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. <laughs> That's and not also, the lyrics. in the song My Sharona, they never say by the knack. The knack is the band. <laughs> I don't know where you got that. I don't either. <laughs> Truth and thought. But I was like, I was singing it, and you were like, what are you singing? And I was like, My Sharona. And I was like, no, you're absolutely not singing My Sharona. My Sharona. <laughs> so this is the double chocolate almond flour cookies. Ooh, that is a smell. Oh, they're, okay, they're almond flour. They're not. They're really tight. A cookie. A tight little. <laughs> Let's try this tight little. <laughs> Oh, okay. I think it's pretty good by virtue of the fact that it's almond flour. I think the almonds really are, are singing here. Yeah. These yeah, are pretty good. These are pretty good. I mean, they are like very dense. These are good tea cookies. Yeah. Ooh. And it's nice because these are gluten free, so people should know. Product of Italy. The Lact Meal Slightly Sweet Milk and Honey Cookies. Product of Italy. Hey, I'm a few generations removed, but I'm also a product of Italy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, we're trying these. Anyway. Are these designed to be eaten with like better cookies? These cookies feel like they're purposely designed for dunking. Cause they're just like, they're sweet and they're like a these fine like, flavor. They're just like pretty hard. You these know? are like designed to put Nutella on. Yeah. But like there's so many other things you can put Nutella on. So it's like, why I this? will say the honey flavor is nice. They're like boring. They're also like a little burnt. I think these are just okay. I will be negotiated up to just okay. I'm just okay. But I think that these are boring and they taste like book covers. I mean, the packaging is like very weird. Perfect. <laughs> Beautiful. I did a good job. Trader Joe's Mayer Lemon. Meyer Lemon. Meyer Lemon. Do the Trader Joe's Meyer Lemon cookie thins. These are not structurally sound. Well then don't crush them. I didn't, they came out this way. <laughs> Why are you blaming me? Why are you blaming me? I've literally done nothing wrong Why for are the you? past at least 45 minutes. <laughs> what? I can't go longer than that <laughs> for religious reasons. But for the past 45 minutes, I've done nothing deserving of criticism. <laughs> This is a cookie? No, no, no. This is like a medieval piece of parchment that has not been preserved this properly. This is just a sweet cracker. I'll eat it. Cracker. What? <laughs> I would love to extract an entire cookie from the package challenge. Like they just, this is a problem too with how thin they what are. What the, they're just how? Not... Come on. Okay, it's delicious though. Wow. That lemon flavor is really present. Wow. It's delicious. A little artificial, but what do you expect? I like it. I mean, these are good tea Is cookies. it all, is it natural though? Maybe it's, maybe I'm just, Oh, it's all natural. Wow, these are all natural flavorings. I don't know, these are pretty good. Yeah. As a child, I would definitely have been like, who wants to see how many of these I can fit in my mouth? <laughs> but what's cool now is that- As I'm, an adult. As an adult. I, I know I can fit at least 30. I can put many in and there, therefore I don't have to try it. We can put it away. <laughs> it's like the time in high school, I like to my entire homeroom, I was like, who dares me to drink this whole gallon of milk before class starts? And like, every, no one was interested. Everybody was like, yeah, don't do that. And I was what? like, oh, I got it. I'm gonna do it. And then I did it. And then I missed two classes because I was in the bathroom having a horrible time. I've told you this before. I had a friend in grad school who was convinced that he could pick up women. He would bring like a whole lemon to a bar and then make eye contact with someone across the bar and then bite into the lemon. Just the whole lemon rind and all. And I was like, how is that supposed to work and he was like I think they'll think I'm just like so interesting and mysterious and I was like that's not how <laughs> they're gonna no, ab <laughs> absolutely think you are unhinged <laughs> and the funny part is that a friend of mine was just like there's no way that'll work on anyone and they argued about it and then like two hours later they were making out <laughs> Trader Joe's Belgian cookies. They're butter almond thins. They're traditional Belgian butter biscuits. Okay, let's open these butter almonds, almonds. Butter <laughs> almonds. <gommons. laughs> Thurman Merman Berman what Sermon. I don't like it. Not a good use of almond. It's just, it's just, it's just too very thin, sweet, too, burnt. too thin. Like they say biscuit on the box, which makes me really think you're supposed to dip these. And so I'm sure they probably are better in tea or maybe in, when they're Belgian, in like a nice beer. Don't get a beer. <laughs> just yeah, okay, go. they are good, move on. Move on, all right, the next, ooh, I like these. I think I just <laughs> broke every one of those cookies when I tossed it on the ground. Rest in pieces. Rest in pieces. All right, the cocoa baton <laughs> wafer cookies by Trader Joe's. I like these. I like cookies of this nature generally, because I like, I just. Fight with them. Yeah, I don't know. I think I like food that can also be kind of a game. Mm. These are great. A delight. Crispy, oh. chocolatey. You can pretend you're smoking like a, a long cigarillo. A little pole for your hole. I actually want. <laughs> these are pretty these good. These are pretty good. They're not amazing, but like they're good. You know yeah. what you're getting. They're not into. like they're not gonna you know. If you've had any cookie like this, you know what they taste they're like. They're not gonna blow your pants off. No. This is another Belgian butter waffle cookie. Would be really good with ice cream. These are like Bad's Troop waffles. It kind of looks like a pineapple. I mean, yeah. It, 
That's, that's all. I'm sorry. Uh, Are you trying to come up with positives about this cookie? Let's turn this into my coming out video. I'm gay. <laughs> They're just okay. Basic. These are the Trader Joe's cookie butter sandwich cookies. I really like the, the Christmas variation of these cookies. So these are basically like shortbread cookies with like little cookie butter. I don't really understand what cookie butter I think is. cookie butter is just like... Speculoos? Yeah. That was pretty good. That was pretty good, actually. <laughs> I think the butter cookies are really good and uh -huh. the cream is just nice. It says what it did on the tin. Yeah. It was like two decadent butter cookies. I was like, yeah, these, these decked. They decked. They decked that tin. And there was butter. These are pretty good. At this point, it's like just sugar. All right. Trader Joe's Aussie style chocolate cream sandwich cookies. These are just Tam Tam. Tam Tams are like a famous brand of Australian like snack cookie and like they have a bunch of different flavors. They're kind of like Australian Oreos. Oh fun. Coated layered cookie. Huh? Yummy. Yeah, okay. It's good. These are really good. I love that I can't say the I can't say the brand. Yeah, inspired by a classic Australian treat. <laughs> they don't want to say what it is. But pretty good. If you are an Aussie that's homesick. I really don't think these would help that much, but <laughs> give it a shot. You know, maybe it'll help. <laughs> fig cookies. These are the Fig Newtons dupe. These are long boys. Fig Newtons, soft. Oh, they're crumbly as Fig Newtons are always like this no, though, man. No, they're not. They're oh, crumbly. Yeah. This one's falling apart in your hand. I did rip it apart purposefully though. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? I was violent with it. I was. I think they're just okay. Uh, we're real quick. It's yeah. like, do you want Fig Newtons but worse? Here you go. Go, go to Trader Joe's. Here you go, go to Trader Joe's. Get Fig Newtons, but like not as good. All right, the crispy, crunchy peanut butter cookies. <laughs> Teeny tiny, crispy peenies. <laughs> I didn't eat. Mm. Yeah. They're, they're bad. I hate the texture. I kind of like them. Really? I think I could only eat them with milk. Kind of. You can't dip them, they're small. Yeah, well, you could make, yeah, okay. <laughs> They're just okay. Uh, just okay? They're just okay. All right, so these are the Trader Joe's Almond Windmill Cookies. Oh, well, they're, they're the windmill facade. Fucking Don Quixote-ass cookies. These are good. These are really good. They're pretty good. Mm. All right, all right. Okay. All right. They're very light. The almond flavor is really good. Buttery, for sure. I don't think they're really great, but they are pretty good. Yeah, I'm not like in love with them, but like, I am very impressed. <laughs> I'm surprised that these were for individual sale. This is the Trader Joe's mini chocolate bag cookies. <laughs> these feel like famous Amos. They are. Oh. Bag cookies, even worse than box cookies usually. These are the superior version the superior. of this. Like this is fun when you want a quick snack and it's These convenient. Are, yeah. But the, you know, they, you know, again, this is like vending machine cookies. Like, they're just it's like okay. a snack. They're yeah, fine. they're just okay. You're not a vending machine, you're a Trader Joe's. Okay. Well, let's hope that this final cookie is our favorite cookie. It's the Cookie Thins Triple Ginger Old World Recipe. I like ginger in tea and I like ginger to eat with sushi. And other than that, I have no interest in ginger. <sighs> it's a triple ginger. I think it's like, whatever, let's just eat it. <laughs> It's just thin gingerbread. It's thin gingerbread. It's thin gingerbread! Which is fine. They're fine. For what they are, they're as good as they possibly could be. Sorry, Which means they're ahead. just okay. Yeah, they're just okay. These are just okay. Wow, did we have any? Oh my God. Did you? We did, we did have, the, the, the problem is the really greats we've already tried in other videos. Yeah. Or they weren't available to us. Yeah, like if there had been dunkers here, ooh baby, those would have been really great. Yeah, the dunkers are Delicious. Go to your Trader Joe's, get some get dunkers. Get dunkers. The dunkers are so good. All right, we've tried all these cookies. Oh my God, I don't want any more cookies. We have a lot of cookies that we've eaten. There's so many things in the world that we won't eat. <laughs> but you watch, the one, the things we will eat, you can watch us do it. Wow, what a good summary of our content. What I love about me is... I love to eat the cookie. Okay, this video's over. This video's over. We love you. We'll, we'll see you next time. All right, kisses. Kisses. Right. Let's clean up so we can let the dog back out. Yep.